I do, yes. A uh, very relieved man, I imagine, this evening. Very relieved, yeah, especially after the kind of week or so that we've just had. Uh, really disappointing results and the, the nature of the results as well. So um, really happy to get a, a strong away performance and kind of put that behind us and, and hopefully kick on now. How important was it to do exactly that, put that behind you today? I think so. I think we needed to see a reaction from the last game. You know, we... we we talked about it and that the way we finished the game and that the nature of that game really hurt us and I think that showed today that we came out and it was a good footballing performance but a very spirited fighting performance as well with some very good individual um, game in there as well. Did you worry that Tuesday night might have an impact on today? No, because I think we've talked about it and addressed it and I think we've, we've discussed why that happened and, and, and what we should do if we get in that situation again. I thought we were 1-0 up, I thought we managed the game well at 1-0, we didn't stress, we didn't show signs of, of uh, panic in there, we stayed very calm um, and then even after 2-0 you see we kept the ball in their half instead of stressing it and, and I think we just saw the game out in a much more mature way. Far be it from me to suggest that three points isn't enough, but was two goals enough? Could, did you feel like you could have got a lot more today? Because they were wide open at times. They were open, they were. Uh, they tried to press us, which we know because we build up short that a lot of teams try and press us and they did leave a lot of space. And once we got through the press, I thought there was a lot of space. We had, I think Ruben had a chance at the end of the first half. There was two or three more second half that, yeah, we can convert. But the important thing is we just keep breaking through the press and creating chances. and. Um, right now I'm happy with two, that'll do me. Yeah, absolutely. You managed to see it out, keep a clean sheet as well. I wonder how much of a difference Carl Cameron made you though? It's an enormous difference. I mean, listen, I'm not, we don't make any excuses for the last three games, but I think we've been patching it together at the back really and we've asked a lot of, you know, um, Pato in goal and, and young Kieran to come in and, and I think they've done a great job. I thought they were both excellent today. Um, but, you know, we ask a lot of them when they come in and we have had to rotate. Patrick, you see Lacey's still struggling with his knee, has been struggling with it. I think, I mean, the leadership of Kyle Cameron back in there just shows how important it was and, and that helped us get that clean sheet. Word for Anthony Patterson, because you say he managed to see it out, which he did, but they still had a couple of chances right at the end there and he had to make a, a smart stave or two. Yeah, and that, you know, that can happen in any game. You know, they, they, they play, the, the boy Quigley up, up front for them gave us all sorts of problems in the air, very, very strong in the air. And, of course, towards the end of the game when it gets stretched, they want to hit him and play off him and, and they got a couple of chances from that And uh, but then you need your goalkeeper to step up and there was a couple of great blocks in there uh, as well and I think we defended really committedly A word for Ruben Rodriguez don't make it too loud because he's sat here listening he's just away to our left hand side a couple of goals four in his last three four in his last three yeah he could have had more today he knows he should have <laughs> shot before half time <laughs> which he'll tell you he should have shot um, but yeah great performance from him uh, on and off the ball I thought he defended very well for us from the front and um, yeah it found the spaces between the lines very, very well and was a, a constant threat. So, yeah, happy with him in goal scoring form. I mentioned Alex Lacey, the fact that, I mean, it's kind of not luck at the minute when it comes to defenders that you, you get one back, you, you lose another one. Um, is, how long is he going to be out for? I, I expect him back by the Stockport game. I hope so, but we have to just scan the knee. He took a bad blo uh, blow on the knee a few weeks ago and we've kind of patched him up because we've been, you know, connell has been away with his injury and Carl Cameron's been away and, and Lacey was probably the lowest risk to get back on the pitch. But after those two games in quick succession, he was really struggling on Wednesday. So we just decided that we, we couldn't risk it today. We had to rest him. Um, hopefully that we can give him now maybe the FA Cup game off and, and um, uh, prepare him for Stockport. And Conor Rawlinson will be back ready for the FA Cup game. Carl Cameron's back came through that really well. So Sam Slocum should be back as well. So it's starting to look brighter from that front. But again, you know, Adam Chickson's playing through. He's got a bad rib injury. I wondered, uh, is that why he came off? He came off, to be honest. He was in a lot of pain before the game. I think against Woking, he, he fell into the post. And we, we don't know if it's broken or not. But uh, he's, he's very, very sore in the ribs and, and has been. Again, he's playing through the pain barrier for us. So we had to get him off. It was too much by the end. And, and hopefully we can give him a rest now. We mentioned all of those defenders. We've not seen Joel Taylor for a while. No, Joel uh, pulled up with just a, a tight groin yesterday, so again we need to treat him with Chickson being struggling a little bit. We hope that we can get him back ready for the FA Cup. Just finally, the last time we spoke, neither of us had slept much, but you'd slept even less. We sleep a bit better now? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I'll have a, a nice sleep tonight. <laughs> Maybe a short relax tomorrow and then back at it on Monday. But yeah, it was. Uh, I'm very just relieved to get that, that three points. You know, when you've lost three games in a row, it's so important to break the, the rot a little bit. And, um, you know, I really think we showed what we were about today.